Anyway, credits time. Hi, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the show. Uh, take a chance to kick back and hang out with the guy who did all the playing. We've got Death Evan 13 here. Ladies and gentlemen, Death Evan 13. Hi, ah, it's so nice to meet you. Ah, it's, it's good to be here. Uh, so, uh, why, why, when did we start doing this? Oh, well, uh, we, you know, decided to break it up a little bit. Yeah, no, just, just go. I mean, and we've got awful credit music to listen to. I've got to read the names of silly Japanese people. I've got to talk about the game. I really don't have time for an interview, so if you could just, well, okay, but I, you suck. Anyway, um... So yeah, Tecmo's Deception, Invitation to Darkness. Four of the six endings, two of them, are repeated. Now, the main thing that happens is... Uh, when I initially played the game in my youth, which, God, must have been at least 15 years ago, um, I was not even safe feeling that. I didn't know I had to back in Chapter 8 when Wizbone was trying to get her. So if you don't save her... And this is going to be a spoiler, so don't, you know, why are you watching the credits if you're not aware of spoilers coming? I'll, I'll, I'll put a warning in the video, though. But this is your last chance. So, Fiona dies. Uh, she's killed by Wizbone, but Astarte gives you the choice. You can save her, kinda. You can either let her be dead, or you can resurrect her as your first monster. And holy damn, is she powerful. I used her for a lot of the game, and then I got to the end and I resurrected Satan, because it seemed like the reasonable thing to do, it's what I agreed to do at the beginning of the game, and the, we got the resurrection ending, where Astarte kills you, resurrects the devil, devil destroys the world. So that's one of the repeated endings. There's also two endings, there's the sad ending, where you say you're going to resurrect the devil, but end up locking it away, so that... It. So the devil doesn't get resurrected, and Fiona's not there to kill you, and you're kind of sad because you don't have any powers, you don't have Fiona, you don't have Astarte, you're just, you're just a dude who's killed everyone he's ever known. Uh, and then the other ending is the hopeful ending, which I think is you lock away the demon, but it sucks because there's no Fiona. And then there's the evil ending and the, and the bad ending again. Yeah, because the evil ending still works. So yeah, so that's about it. I might do that at some point. Um, I'm not going to do it right away, because I've done, well, since video 7.13 or so, I've done all that in about a 24-hour period, so I'm a little burnt out on Tecmo's Deception. But hopefully in another couple weeks, or months, or who knows, I'll come back, and I'll pick up from Chapter 8, and I'll run to the end, I'll show off the monster, and yeah, because I'll have to do the entire, like, God, 16 chapters again. and That's kind of a pain. Some of those chapters were no fun. Those generals were kind of a pain in the ass. But anyway, uh, Tecmo's Deception. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Have a great night. Later on.